a day too, y'all. I had a great night's nice rest. Uh, it was a little drizzly this morning, so I, I didn't want to video my setup, so I'll do that another time. It was, uh, it was a great night's sleep, perfect weather. Got about nine or 10 to go uh, back to Unicoi and then all today. Great so far. Day number two. a lot of these in this section a lot of these little stealth campsites without water you have to make sure you have water but there's a bunch of these cool little campsites the Georgia Green Tunnel all day long this is some of the coolest parts I love this Big climb of the day. It's been a couple, you know, up and down. It's so nothing big, but that one probably three or four hundred feet. That was pretty tough. Up on a ridge, wind blowing, it's nice and cool. So I think we're over, or right at four miles, maybe. One got nine for today, maybe ten. I didn't really look at the mileage when we got up this morning. It's another uphill. It's like we're going uphill some more. All right, y'all. Here we go. Chattahoochee Grab. Uh, this is Jackson Trail, Jackson, Jackson Gap Trail, I guess goes up that way. Yeah. You know, water down there. We have blue blades. We are headed this way. I meant to say earlier, um, so far on this trail we've met four southbounders who will finish. One will finish to or two uh, look like a young man and a young lady together. We'll finish today. We saw them yesterday. And then this morning we saw uh, two other gentlemen coming through a uh, trail named Hell Yes Jesus, which is kind of odd, but that's kind of cool. Anyway, um, that's awesome, man. And they're finishing, he'll finish tomorrow. So that's four Southbounders. One of them, the, the second group that we met, uh, they started in June. They've only been on a trail for four months. So they have been putting in some miles. It's got to be an average of about somewhere around 20. And uh, not sure how many zeros or negros they might have had along the way. But man, that's cool. It was cool to see them. You know, just gets the juices flowing for next year. I cannot wait to get on this trail, head toward Maine. 2,200 miles, baby. Taking all y'all with me. They've come through here and you know the, the maintainers have cleared this out but you leave early enough some of these blowdowns are going to be here and you're going to be climbing over and under them and through these rocks which i'm trying to do without killing myself anyway I mean, that's a big old tree so i guess the point i'm making is that when you're hiking you never you know it's just not an open trail sometimes you got to blaze on around or over or under so you just got to be ready for just about anything now most of the trail is maintained really well and uh, those AT clubs come out and do a great job of keeping it clear but we're gonna start sometime at the beginning of March and there's a chance that this won't be clear so you got to do what you got to do running up the trail <laughs> oh man that's insane oh well all right this is the last big up before we get to the top of blue mountain and then it's a mile and a half basically straight down so this will be one of the toughest parts just the last little part of the day so this is the at up and then down here we go y'all
can hear and see the road, so we're not far from the truck. Anyway, it's the last little bit. I might get a little one more before we get done. But that's not bad, 22 miles on the Appalachian Trail from Neal's Gap to Unicoi. Awesome. Just a great hike. Low gap, 9.6 it says. According to what I did, it was more like 10. We're at Unicoi Gap. Yeah. Just finishing up. Truck's right up there. So, it's been a great hike. Somewhere in the vicinity of 22 miles. From Neal's Gap to Unicoi Gap. Spent the night at Low Gap last night. Great nice rest, like I said. First shakedown, getting ready for next year. All's well. Keep you posted. Somewhere between now and first of the year I'll do, or after the first year probably. Once I get my gear all dialed in, I'll do some gear reviews on what I'm gonna use. And then uh, we're getting ready. I love being out here, I absolutely love it. So if you get a chance, get out in the woods. That's all I can tell you. Here we go, there's the parking lot. There's the last little bit of the trail. All right, y'all, have a good. One.